Devin with 3G at Cattail Creek doing a roof inspection. To my understanding, there are some repairs that went on here. I'm just trying to wrap my head around everything. Um, there's some weird stuff. Definitely damage in some places, but it's just a little bit odd to me. These all look like repairs. There. I did notice too. A little bit gutter damage. You can see that dent. You can see that dent. There's a lot of this tar, silicone, shingles, kind of just, everything's just kind of everywhere, which I haven't really seen before. A lot of nails, literally all over the place. So I'm not sure if that's the shingles coming up or whoever did the repairs or whoever installed this roof initially. Uh, he's, the tenant did say that um, all these turtle vents and I guess the furnace vent were just recently replaced here. I mean, that's I guess what I'm struggling with is it is supposedly a new roof, but it does seem to be in rather rough condition, repairs or not. The more I look at it, I mean, it's... Yeah, they were saying the valleys were just replaced. Maybe that has something to do with it as well. This other side here. I'll note too, those gutters on the bottom are full of granules. And he seems to think from down there he can see, and I, I can too to an extent, um, a lot of divots in the roof just from impact. I know with these darker roofs it's harder to tell, but there's definitely some soft spots. And things like this are just not sure how that comes about. Right here. That lower part, um, same just as up here, just random little repairs, pieces of shingles, nails, gutters are way worse than up here, completely full of granules. Some of these gaps and things of that nature, just the roofs I've seen, it's a little bit different. So everything seems to be kind of uneven and Like right here, I don't know what's... These must be repairs. These must be patches of some kind. And they're just really thin strips that were put on there. kind of seems to be falling apart to me. But I'll end that there. <laughs>